What is up everybody? Video Addict here and I've got Geek Fuel. EXP? Okay. not too long ago maybe it was a month or so ago where they told us that we are no longer doing a monthly subscription box they have gone to a quarterly subscription box yet you still pay the same thing only they just instead of like $15 a month you're now paying $45 a month so it's like you're paying the same amount but getting one box but you're only getting charged four times a year you're still paying the same yearly amount, but I don't know. It, it feels like you're getting a better deal, but I don't know. This right here is supposed to be better high-end gear. So all we can do is get into it and determine, is this cool high-end freaking geek stuff? Or is it just the same old geek fuel? Which if it's the same old geek fuel, I'm gonna be very upset because even though I loved old Geek Fuel, I want new Geek Fuel to be better. Otherwise, why did that change? All right, I'm gonna open this bad boy up. This is what you're gonna see. Warning, contains spoilers. Oh, yeah. Fuji Wawa, are you kidding me? All right, first off, we got our pins, pin pals, I don't like them, okay? Bring back the little freaking robot and make some robot pins. I don't like these. These are so just weak. Anyway, I got some chicken green and the old guy from Planet of the Apes. Pen Pal, Planet of the Apes edition. I, I don't like it. I got Dr. Zeus, Zeus and Dr. Zero. You know, not as cool as the little robot. I don't like it. This right here is a Bob's Burger, uh, whatchamacallit, a apron, okay? I'm not gonna freaking open this thing up because I don't, I don't like Bob's Burgers. I'm not gonna lie to you. But there's the apron and some weird guy with a weird mustache. I don't know. If he's trying to look like that guy, I understand, but I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna leave that in here because I don't want it. I'm not gonna use it. I don't understand Bob's Burgers, so therefore it's not something I'm gonna wear. All right, next up, this is from Marvel, and this is a Wolverine number one comic cover, classic canvas art. I guess they sent me the canvas and I'm going to have to go, oh no, it's like the whole picture from me. Okay then. Limited series. Okay. This is actually kind of cool. I like this. Okay. Right there. And it's a canvas little photo. I, I kind of dig this because it has the hanger already on it. You could, if you have like a little series of these, you could just create you a cool little lineup. I like that. That is good stuff right there. Very good job here. Very good job on that. All right, next up is going to be Game of Thrones Winter is Here collection. Okay, you can use your box to make a backdrop for this. Ooh, 43 of these things to collect. Tyrion Lannister? I wonder how short he is if he's a little vinyl figure. He'd have to be like this big. Instead of being this big, he gonna be like this big. Arya Stark, Sansa Stark, the Hound. Ooh, I would like the Hound or the White Walker. Those are the ones I would like. To make in order to make the stand in there, 
the Night King would be awesome. Come on. I don't, I don't know. I feel anticipation. Oh! Is that the Night King? Dude, I got the Night King guy. I got the Night King. Yes, I did. Hey, look. I got the Night King guy. He's all white, like he's a glow-in-the-dark figure, but he didn't look like he was glow-in-the-dark. Like he was glowing. Oh. I'm going to sit him right there. He's going on the thing, without a doubt. Freaking Night King and all. All right, moving on. Uh, We're going to save this for last t-shirt. Uh, next up, ooh. I have the Force Awakening. Oh, Awakening? The Force Awakens exclusive minifigure. Chronicles of the Force from Lego Star Wars. I don't, I don't know. I guess, uh, I do like Legos. Basically, it's like a big, uh, product. <laughs> It's basically saying, hey, look at all this cool stuff you should go and buy. You know, there's actual, all this stuff is actual Legos. You should go buy it. Yeah, this is not a book. I mean, this is a book that tells you what everything is and basically lets you know what you need to know to be able to go and try and find it somewhere to order it and buy it. Yep, that's what it is. This is a catalog. This is a this ain't an entertainment book. There you go. Pretty neat. I, I, I like it. Age of six and up. I'm, I'm in that category. Alright, so this I'm pretty excited about. Okay? We have a Kawabunga pizza cutter. Boom. I am... I've already got some other Ninja Turtle stuff over there. I will keep this too. All right. Oh. Who doesn't love pizza? My fellow dudes and dudettes, some major slice and dice action is in order for your next pizza pie. No kitchen is compli <laughs> No kitchen is complete without this pie sigh. Unsheath and unleash your hunger while you chow down in the underground. Remember, forgiveness is divine, but never pay full price for a late pizza. Kawabunga. Caution, not a toy. Good. That's a good thing to tell people. All right. Uh, it's a side pizza cutter. Kawabunga. That's awesome. <laughs> I don't even have any use for it because my pizza cup's cut already. But Jesus, this is awesome. It looks like a mirror. I need to take this to your lady and be like, here, this is your little makeup checking mirror. You know? That's, that's freaking cool, man. I like that. That is freaking awesome. A side piece of country. That's freaking hilarious. All right, and that's it for the box other than our t-shirt. This month's t-shirt is another Deadpool thing. All right. I like Deadpool. This is a Deadpool Marvel officially licensed t-shirt. I like it. It feels nice and soft. It feels a little warm. Like it's going to be really hot to wear. All right. Right. You got your pirate. You got him as a chef. You got him uh, doing sock puppets. Got him hanging upside down on Spider-Man's web. You got him here just sulking. You got him over here trying to kill his other self. And you got him down here eating a taco. I like it. It's cool. It looks a little small, but we'll try it on see what we got. Anyway, that is really freaking cool. I like it. It's a very soft shirt. Yeah. I am a fan because the t-shirt was cool. The freaking pizza cutter is awesome. The 
Wolverine art is pretty nice. The Bob Burger thing is a miss. Uh, the Star Wars book is okay. The little Ice King. It says glow in the dark edition, so yes. I'm pretty stoked. I like it. Will I keep it? I don't know. I, I have a feeling I might give it a couple of rounds just to kind of see where they go with it. It was right the first time. Will you stand the hell up? <laughs> 